What's up? No. What's up, Booski? I'm back. It is day two. Let's say 48 full hours of me being on a lifestyle change diet, all this stuff. It's day two of 300. And I am down an additional two pounds, which makes it a grand total of six pounds. And if you want to know how I feel and what I'm doing to get there, you know what to do. Stay tuned. I'll be back. Hey, shorty can you see can you see it's the chin chin and <laughs> i'm probably down at least two centimeters in my chin and i'll take it a win is a win baby it's not just about the weight loss it's about me sticking to something and investing in something that makes me feel good self-care self-love it's all about self how do you expect to be good for anybody else if you don't even know how to take care of yourself today was an awesome day i just wanted to get on here and talk to you guys about what happened in video one in the last video that you might have seen um i just really had a little bit of a mini meltdown and i haven't had one since i'm still going through a little bit of the detox symptoms um only because i'm eating um, and I'm going to do a what I eat in one week, what, what I eat in a day, that kind of thing. So you can guys can see specifically instead of me just telling you. But it's because I'm not eating pizzas. I'm reducing the amount of breads, the carbs. I have some potatoes and because I am a French fry freak. I love French fries. But I'm reducing that level of carb intake and all the bad stuff that I was eating prior to Monday so my body's like really girl we're still trying to adjust that's why I'm not necessarily wanting to go into the gym because my energy is it's there it's getting better than what it was yesterday but it has depleted and I don't want to get on the gym and hurt myself until I know I'm okay because there is a bit of a calorie deficit as far as what I was eating before to what I'm eating now so um, I'm just happy and it makes me feel good. Like I just, it feels good to see some level of success. I'm not saying I have to put up big numbers, but leader, but it might be water weight. It could be anything, whatever it is. It's a loss. That means my body is like, okay, you're doing something different. So I'm going to take it for what it is. Um, likely, um, I'm going, I'm still trying to figure out if I want to work out in the morning or if I want to work out at night, the likelihood of me getting up at five o'clock in the morning to go to the gym. I don't know. It scares me, but I feel like I might be a whole lot more effective and I feel like my sleep will be even better to where I always wake up at one o'clock in the after I always wake up at like one or two o'clock in the morning and just wake up and sometimes I'll wake up and it's hard for me to go back to sleep. I feel like if I work out closer to that time that I can just have a full night's rest, get up and do it all over again. So I'm still trying to juggle whether or not I want to do that. Hey, this has just been a very exciting and invigorating thing. I have a whole lot that I want to do with this channel, but I really want to focus on this. I really want to inspire you guys. I say this every time. Um, I've been saying this the last couple of times that I've been doing these types of videos. I just really want to inspire people and I want people to feel inspired to invest in themselves and do the things that make them feel happy and the things that will add value. And I feel like as I get healthier and as I lose more weight, it will add value. And honestly, I don't even feel and I, I feel full, like I'm eating a decent amount of food. I'm not trying to starve myself. But even with that being said, and I guess it's another part of the detox because I'm not eating that like a, a large portion of something or a large portion of something bad. My stomach, I feel like it's shrinking a little bit, like not the the tummy, the rolls from what you guys can see, but the actual organ, it feels like it's shrinking. And I'm all for it. So what I'm likely going to do, because I think I said in my last video, I wasn't going to share my weight. I'm just going to share my weight. It is what it is. Um, just so you guys don't think I'm trying to pull like numbers and I'm just up here just for views or content. Like I'm really honestly shedding the pounds and I can't wait till at least I lose at least another like 20 to where like we can get rid of this first chin. Oh, girl, I will be taking all kinds of selfies. My Facebook friends probably going to follow me like this girl because you got so many selfies. I don't care. I'm working hard and I'm doing what I'm supposed to do and I'm so focused so but anyway I just wanted to come in here and talk to you guys I hope you guys are having a great day um if you want to comment engage with me comment down below we welcome all positive comments all negative comments will be ignored um but I just hope you guys have a great day I'm just feeling good it's day two day two. Oh, and just so y'all can see hold on let me get my busted phone it is Day two, I, there's no way to flip that around so you can see. Oh, it is day two. It is March 8th at 514. 
So y'all get to see. Ugh. Anyway, but Booski, I have nothing else to say. We're going to keep it cute. We're going to keep it mute. Cheer me on. Say, go, fatty, go, go, fatty, go, go. Don't say that. Just, just cheer me on. Because whenever I get to the gym, I feel like life is about to be real. Clearly, you have to do some type of cardio, some type of toning. And to me, I'm better at walking. I know a lot of people who can do the running thing. I don't know if I want to run and stuff like that. Because my joints get out sometimes. My bones crack. I'm a little older. and There's a lot of meat on these bones. So I feel like... We're gonna start with walking. I might try to stairmaster. I've never, I've never done stairmaster, and a lot of people look like they're about to die. And I feel like that's a great cardio workout. So I might try that. Just try to like mix it up and maybe do a little bit of bike, maybe a little elliptical. But I at least want to have at least forty-five minutes of cardio. If I'm feeling good, then maybe an hour. But we'll see. We'll see. But today I'm just gonna coast. I'm gonna edit some videos. I'm gonna get a good night's rest because come the morning, I might be at the gym. Or come the evening, I might be at the gym, but we'll see. Let me get up, matter of fact, let me get up so you guys can see. So I'm gonna try to find a tighter shirt, like a tank top or something so you can see as my stomach goes down and my thighs and the meats, the meats and the glutes go down. I want you guys to be able to see that and see the progress. So I think I have a tank top somewhere in here that I can find. So y'all be able to see that kind of thing. And I'll do that every time I do this video. So yeah, that'll be cute. Yeah. All right. Hey, y'all. I couldn't find a tank top. So we're just going to have to spin. And I'm going to try to put the shirt close to my close to my body. So here we go. Not sticking in. Not sticking in. Sucking in. This is me. This is me. All of me. All, let me stop. All of me. Yes. We're looking to tone. Gosh, can, can we get the thighs? We're looking to tone the thighs. Lift and cup the butt. It's going down. Day two. Over and out. Can y'all tell? Can y'all tell? Can y'all tell? Just be honest. Don't lie to me. Don't lie to me. Tell me. Tell me. 